Hey, what is up guys? Mr. Reverts here, and today I want to talk to you guys about a really controversial video that's been going around all over social media and the news lately. And it's a kid named Keaton Jones, and he attends Horace Menard Middle School in Tennessee. But in the video, his mom was filming him, I guess after she picked the kid up from school. And he's crying his heart out because he was a victim of a bullying attack. And then the mother posted the video onto Facebook and it pretty much just blew up and all these celebrities are tweeting to him and inviting the kid to all these events you know that kind of stuff is really cool and then i heard about this the day the video went public and probably the craziest thing about this that came out of this entire ordeal was a gofundme account in the name of keaton jones and as i'm recording this video right now it already has fifty-eight thousand dollars. and by the time i upload this video it should be well over 60 grand and i even posted on twitter saying can someone bully me so i can get some cash i really didn't mean it literally i was honestly trying to make some light out of the entire situation because i know bullying is a serious topic but the fact that all these celebrities came out of nowhere to show their support is really really amazing to me however about the GoFundMe account this account does not actually belong to the kid or the parents this is a third-party GoFundMe account so it could be like freaking Mr. Don next door in his living room that set this up and now he's gonna be getting all of that money we don't know where that money is going to we don't know if he's actually gonna send the money to the kids family or like an anti-bullying support group or something like that and and as I'm sitting right here recording this video and watching these people, they're just donating and donating and again and again. And it's not even going to the kid or his family. So the person behind this account could possibly just pocket the cash, uh, but hopefully he doesn't do that. Also, a rumor was going around that the kid said the N-word to another classmate in school, which is what prompted the kid to be bullied. But I mean, I'm not sure if that is true or not. I don't want to touch base on that too much, but if someone can prove to me that uh, this happened, I would really like to see that a lot now. I also saw some people say that the mom's Facebook page had some photos of her and the family holding up Confederate flags. And because of that, a lot of people are saying that the family is racist and the mom has posted on Facebook a lot of stuff that is highly political such as kneeling in the NFL but I mean I believe that kind of stuff should be put aside and the kid should be the main focus not the mom's beliefs but as for the racism part again this has not been proven yet so I'm really not going to touch base too much on that but the kid is showing some signs of empathy and he really does seem distraught about this which I wouldn't think a racist person would show but the sister of Keaton is claiming the family isn't racist over on Twitter and this is what has a lot of people debating on the internet but hopefully more news can come out of this and we can can get to the bottom of this now as for the gofundme account again the family did say on twitter that they are not working or asking for donations with this guy so uh if you're donating to him you you might be getting scammed so my advice would be to not donate to any kind of third party fund ever make sure it's the actual source so guys tell me your thoughts about this in the comments down below because i'm really really curious to know what you guys have to say about this entire situation also drop a like if you guys enjoyed the video and I uh, hope you guys are enjoying these little gameplay commentaries that I'm doing right now. I really do like to talk about some, uh, you know, highly controversial stuff within our uh, society right now because I think it's interesting. I look up that stuff a lot and hopefully you guys do uh, find it cool as well. So uh, the gameplay you're watching here is a 21 and 9 type 100 gameplay. I just kind of like doing these little throwback gameplay commentaries because this is the stuff that I used to watch back in the day, back in Modern Warfare 2 and Black Ops 1. Like this was the stuff that was really really hot on the call of duty scene and uh, i'm trying to bring it back i don't know it's just something that i do want to relive the past and because i feel that was the best time that i had in the call of duty community so uh, i'm trying to do that again and talk about some pretty cool stuff and maybe you guys like it i don't know uh let me know what you guys think about this in the comments and uh, yeah thanks for watching until next time i'll see you later